Finance Friday. There's a major shift that's occurred within our communities throughout the United States and that we've very much moved and spread out as families. It was very common for many generations to live in the same community, sometimes in the same neighborhood uh, that their parents used to and that their grandparents used to. But now we're living in different states. Now we're definitely further away from each other. And so that's created a quite a unique scenario when it takes, when, it, when you start thinking about the culture of taking care of our aging loved ones. And so the important thing to have a look at in this concept right now of Finance Friday is what's the conversation that you've had with your parents or grandparents about who's gonna take care of them physically and who's gonna assist them financially. And so they might have the finances and the wherewithal, but as they've aged, they don't wanna to have to go into a community. They would like to be able to have some assistance or some caregiving from some loved ones. And so, and other people don't want that. They want that independence. And so it's important to be able to not delay this conversation especially with the baby boomer uh, um, market, the demographic of those that are born 1946 to 1964, they're turning, 10, uh, to turning 65 at the rate of 10,000 people every single day. You don't wanna delay this conversation. It's better to just rip the bandit off, have this tough conversation, be able to just ask, what are your plans and how can we assist you? How can we be a benefit? If I'm down here in the great state of Texas, my parents are all the way up in Wisconsin and there's no other family up there with them. How can we help assist them as they start approaching retirement? It's an important part of the conversation and it doesn't make sense to be able to neglect it and nor does it make sense to have to make decisions because we have to because something has happened and all of a sudden now we're really up, um, uprooting or we're changing our lives dramatically and sometimes making some poor decisions because we didn't plan ahead. Again, I would encourage anybody to reach out to those professionals financial advisors, insurance agents, uh, people that you trust. If we could be of value here at Hotel Insurance Services, as you look at that plan for your clients and your families, we'd love to be able to do that. Feel free to reach out to us. Shrimps out.